niece and everyone was here. Then my grandson was here also. I don't know who took the picture. And there is a one lady in white was behind. I've seen of like dark shadows before, lah, but I don't know what is it. Then my dog actually saw something like almost every day. She'll look into space, ah, then like in the days, then she'll just look, or sometimes she'll just like shiver a bit. So I knew something was wrong already. I didn't really see like a solid apparition or but can feel lah. the vibe is really different. Why did you close the door just now? Because the spirit is inside. So I close it. Especially like 210. When I go to kitchen, right, I can't really feel it. Like when something's standing next to you, that kind of feeling. Mary! For this unit, um, there's two entities, but one entity has been removed before uh, during my first visit. And then this time round, we came to cleanse. It's uh, actually a lady spirit. I know that this entity likes to follow her back. Wherever she goes, entity will follow her. Then she likes to bring the dogs down in the middle of the night. So I told her, don't always go up the trap. 12 a.m. That's very bad. All they eat very strong. Uh, both here, always bring on. Two, three o'clock also bring on. So this thing will follow back. I understand. I knew that. It's not long, right? My doctor told me, she said, uh, Mother, Mother, I got hear sound eh, in my room. I feel something, you know, Mother, not right this. I said, yeah, your room is going to clean up. I said, very messy. You have to clear, clear all your things because the more dirty it is, the entity will love to come. You can see that uh, there was a bit of challenge. Uh, the door is not locked, but when I want to enter, the door is locked and it closed by itself. That's the worst thing. What happened was uh, they have encountered a few times and uh, one of it, if I'm not wrong, they actually shared with me was they were taking a group family photo in the room. When my niece and everyone was here, when my grandson was here also. So we were sitting down, we, we, we see uh, uh, big, you know, TikToks, you know. Then we was laughing, talking, and the light is dim, uh, dim. I didn't on the light. So I was sitting here, you know, here, this, this place. Take picture. I don't know who took the picture. And there is a one lady in white was behind. She asked my mom, hey, who's the lady beside me? Then my mom said, no, there's nobody, right? it's just me. Right? And my cousin, then my, my aunt said, no, there's somebody, something there. Then when I saw the picture, then my 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 nephew, my nephew grabbed the, the, the phone. He said, Toko, Toko, let me see the, the picture. Then see, ah, your house got more. He said, there's a lady behind. It's not like one person saw it. A few of them saw it and then they want to see again to reconfirm, but they are so scared that uh, the person who took the pictures right quickly just delete the picture off because it's, it's very scary, very worried. I saw because I don't want to frighten the kids. So I say, no, 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 it's not true. I must delete. I don't want to keep because it's not clean. Huh? I won't keep. Huh? 
He said, Toko, you show me, you show me. I say, no, no, no. Uh, no more ready, delete ready. I say, no, I see nothing. But actually, I saw. It's a white figure with long hair. He also like that, all posing. Oh, no. I too short, I too short. Place is dirty, they all, you keep on having a lot of negative energy. So one of the number one things is wash your wash your leg from this part all the way down. She always, I don't know, sometimes she walk down, got people tap her, uh, then she oi, like that. The funny part is when I'm outside, right, like in the living room, uh, the kitchen, right, I feel scared at night. But when I enter my room, right, I feel scared, but then yet I feel very safe. I don't know why. Maybe the thing was protecting me or I don't know, I really don't know. I shared with the occupants was the person keep on, I mean the entity, the third dimension keep on looking at her whether she's eating, sleeping, showering or anything, sitting there, playing games, it's always there. So she always have this un very uneasy feeling. Uh. So now it's all clear, so I wish the uh, occupants all the best and uh, I gave them some uh, so-called standard operating procedure okay, to know what to do when you go out, you come back, what should you do and I bless the home and uh, to make sure that they are well safeguarded away from this type of unwanted uh, entity.